accomplish that kind of thing? Uh, basically, just go in and win games. But also develop as a basketball player myself, and not try to go out there and live up to the hype. Mm -hmm. Just go out there, have fun, and get a chemistry down, pack my teammates. Can you talk a little about the chemistry, how important that is? Because you know you guys are all kind of getting to know each other now, but now you're gonna really start playing in some games this next week. Oh, it's key because you know some of us, most of us that's playing some of these gonna be on the team more than likely. So see how that goes and uh, just get a feel for each other. So then when the season come and training can't come around. In preseason, we already know where each other need to be and get it clicking. Like, what has Flip been talking to you about? Uh, get, what, what does he want to see out of you? Oh, well, basically just run the team and you know uh, get get my teammates involved and uh, take over when I can. But you know, we just get used to playing the pick and roll, taking the certain angles, learning from Sam Cassell. You know, every time he feel like I could do something different, he tell me what angles to get down, and how low to get down. So they both and the key to me uh, uh, taking the process a little easy. But it's gonna be an up and down time. And also work on your defense. How much of a how much you gonna concentrate on on that in the summer? Oh, a whole lot. You know, you see in here in practice, I'm trying to be talkative and fighting over screens and getting used to. Uh, you know, these are bigger guys and they're stronger. They know how to set screens, so you can't stop. You got to keep fighting through it and getting over. How long have, typically have you since you've been playing point? Does it take to kind of get to know where your where your teammates like the ball? You know, their tendencies, that kind of deal. Not long. You know, you know which guys are your shooters and which guys are not your shooters. That's on the wing. You know, which guys that that can put on the floor and attack, or some guys just like catch and shoot type players, or people that cut to the best. So you, get, you basically just got to know your personnel. You said you plan on playing, uh, playing all five games? Oh, yeah, that's my goal. I want to play. I ain't played in no game since Kentucky, so <laughs> yeah, I want to play as much as I can, but you know, I'm just going to do whatever the uh, organization and the coaches that I want me to do. John, you ever play with a big like JaVale? Huh? You ever play with a big like JaVale? Oh, uh, yeah, CJ Leslie. They both athletic can go get it. You know, CJ probably more skilled and permanent, but mm -hmm. I never had no one as JaVale height that can just throw it anywhere. He's going to go get it and rebounds out of the gym. You're going to have some time to relax and enjoy yourself a little bit in Las Vegas? Um, <laughs> You're yeah, but I'm basically down there to take care of business. But, you know, yeah. days we got off. You know, practice and have a little time to walk around, but you know you gotta take uh in this love you gotta make sure you're not uh on your legs as much as you did. You know, they got games back to back, so you gotta get used to that. John, how much does it help you to have Sam Cassell as like an extension of, of Flip Saunders to learn this offense from the point guard standpoint? Um, that's a big plus because you know I had him when I was at Kentucky, Coach Strickland, Rock Strickland is a NBA coach, they both taught me and teaching me. Like Sam said, he he wasn't an athlete, but he was a great shooter. I knew how to get by people in different angles at different spots, so I'm just learning as much as I can from him. You still Rod? keep in touch with Rod? Yeah, I talked to him. I talked to him yesterday. Did he he, talk he to might you about, come out in Vegas for a little bit. Did he talk to you about Washington and what to look forward to? Oh, uh, yeah, he said it's a great city and it's going to be a great uh, excitement if you're playing, but you're going to have your up and downs at times like it's the most rookies do, so that's why I got to get myself to play through. Great. Good stuff. Great shot. Thanks.